hi guys and welcome to my channel my name is rosie and today i wanted to film my what i got for christmas so i just wanted to do a disclaimer i am super 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 grateful for everything that i was lucky enough to be gifted over christmas and i just wanted to say a massive thank you to everyone who gave me presents christmas isn't about presents or anything like that it's about spending time with your friends and family that being said i just love sharing hauls i love watching hauls so i thought i'd share it with you guys i'm in no way trying to brag about anything i'm super grateful for everything and yeah i hope you enjoy having a look at everything that i've got uh, let's jump on in i won't do it in any particular order so i'm because i've got it all sat behind me and i kind of want to like pop it back when i get the chance to so the first thing the first thing i got i'm actually wearing so that is this really cool group t-shirt i love these types of t-shirts um they add a little bit of personality and everything um and yeah another thing that i got was this super cute uh, rose quartz necklace this was from my nan and it's really cool because you can take the little screw top out and it's a little bottle and you can put stuff like perfume in you could roll up a like secret message or whatever and put that in there maybe a spell if you like that thing some fairy dust something like that i remember i used to have this locket that actually anybody who watched the vampire diaries will know it was a replica of elena's bavane locket and I used to put glitter in the locket just to pretend it was the vein. <laughs> uh, this kind of reminds me a bit of that. Like, you could do whatever you want with it. It's really cute as well. And, like, if you want, you can just have it empty and just have a cute little pendant on. But, yeah, it's really cute and I really love it. So, yeah. It's really different as well from the ones I usually have. I lost my rose quartz one of these. I was super sad about it. But I usually get them in this form. And I think I'm going to have to buy some different variety ones off of Etsy when I get paid. Just because I would really like an obsidian one. They look really cool. But yeah, I love the rose quartz bottle. It's so different yeah i've got a plethora of chocolate which will be lasting me for for ages hopefully it should be lasting me for ages if it's not i need to have some words with myself so from my mum i got the a selection from hotel chocolate because we like love it and we're obsessed but i'm not a huge fan of like the pastry ones it's just gets me new so this is uh the enchanted forest so this is milk and caramel milk trees i love the caramel milk stuff great and then i also got a gingerbread set and these are milk chocolate with a hint of gingerbread spice and these are also like really good as well and then i got some little penguins so these are milk chocolate and white chocolate tummies so they're all really cute i love them and then my boyfriend got me a selection of my favorite chocolates just like you shove them in the bag so they're maltesers buttons and minstrels right that's upside down and minstrels so yeah that's really cool i'm going to be so chocolated out after christmas you don't even know because we've also downstairs got giant celebration tubs there's quality streets there's heroes there's like the victoria biscuits we've got fox's biscuits we've got like the mns selection there's so much chocolate i can't the first of my percy items my aunt got me a percy hamper and it was super cute and in it there was the percy pillow look at him isn't he great it would it be a rosy haul without Percy items. Just look at him. He just looks so happy. He's got a little 
kiss and the heart are on the fabric which is so soft and in his little ears as well he's got the heart it's so cute i love it it's from the the penny loves percy collection that one and then from my mum i was wearing these all of yesterday for all of christmas i got the little percy booties they're so soft and cute and i'm in love they are definitely one of my favorites i love those types of slipper sheens because they're like shoes but like slippers i don't know why i said it like that so from my parents i got the super cute two-faced uh, eyeshadow set so this is called the christmas bake shop and it comes with a better than sex mini mascara which i love the minis because i can never use a full tube of mascara and it also came with three little cookie like trays you know so it's like it's in the oven like that and these come out it's so it's such a super cute idea so this one is obviously the chocolate chip cookie and it smells like chocolate and that's the color story and then there is the gingerbread one these ones all smell like gingerbread and that's the color story so the cookie one has a highlighter in it this one has the uh contour a bronzer shade and the last one super cute so it's a sugar cookie one and that's the color story and it's got the little blush in and i just think it's super cute it's so i don't know it's such a novel thing but yeah so when they're all together it's like baking trays isn't that the coolest i also got uh kvd tattoo liner in the shade trooper these are my favorite liners i swear by them and i i literally wouldn't be able to do my eyeliner with anything different it's just the brush tip is so amazing and i love it now i have opened these already because i'm wearing a pair today but my mom got me my mom and dad got me these um super cute socks they're got little different I don't know if you'll be able to see their little different dogs that's what they're themed after i love socks i literally said to to my mum even though like socks are like you know presents i said to my mum i said i need socks like i literally hate buying things like socks and underwear because it's like i really want to spend my money on like nice cute things but like socks to me don't fall into that so like these are adorable and hopefully they'll last me until my birthday <laughs> i have a couple of things from my different friends i wanted to showcase so from one of my friends it got this super cute fake plant he's a little sheep is so cute it lives on my bookshelf and it decorates it and look how cute he is <laughs> and look how cool the um the ombre on the fake leaves are isn't that i just think it's so cool and from another one of my friends i got these lovely like fluffy socks it's got such a cute design on it i love this i think it's called argyle print i love it i'm obsessed i've got these like i'm not sure what you call them they're like the vest jumpers and one of them is in the argyle print and this is like a brown version i've never seen it and they're really cool and also i love fluffy socks i've literally been sleeping in fluffy socks because like it's been super cold and like my arthritis is like going like it cannot cope with it and from a different friend i got this really cute jelly cat seal if any if you if you knew me i love seals i've got too many seals uh look at them all vibing up there i love them so this one is super cute and it can be a bookshelf decoration as well um it's just being adorable like i don't know what to call him yet so i also got like two packs of percy pig sweets so like one of them came with this seal i've just left those downstairs so they should be in this hall but they're not but yeah look how cute he is what do you think i should call him let me know in the comment section down below
I also got a really cute uh, eyeshadow palette from my boyfriend and it is so so cute so I love the gingerbread spice palettes they are my favorite so I always ask for the next in rendition and this one was pumpkin spice it's pumpkin pie themed look how cool this is so it smells like pumpkin pie I think don't quote me on that I literally can't smell anything but my mum has told me that this is what they all smell like they are all scented and I've used it on my eyes today and I will use it on Christmas day look how cute look at it look oh, the shimmers in this are beautiful literally do not need any help they are just stunning and look at it it's so cool it's literally one of my favorite things i've got and i love it so much something really helpful that my nan got me for christmas is a 2023 planner i've already started filling it out i'm using it to uh do my youtube planning in put, putting all my appointments in because goodness knows i have way too much medical appointments i have to keep track of but yeah look and it's quite a cute design i'm not like the biggest fan of leopard print but this one is really pretty because it's black and gray i kind of like that vibe also it literally would not be from my nan if it wasn't leopard print she loves leopard print but yeah i like it and the pen it comes with writes really nice you know when it's like satisfying and it makes your hand drying like neater so this stuff is in this bag is all from my nan so she literally spoiled me <laughs> i literally was not expecting this because she helped me um buy my like she lent me some money to pay for my new car with that i got in november and i can't believe that she has done this but yeah i ask for lots of craft stuff for christmas because when my arthritis is really flaring up and it's cold months and everything i literally spent way too much time on screens or like feeling a bit mopey so this stuff really really helps so i love doing diamond art and look how cute he is he looks adorable doesn't he i'm super excited to get to do these they're so much fun there's also a detangling head brush head brush hair brush it's got a really cute like marbled uh thing i because my medicine makes my hair fall out i get a really bad problems with knotting under the nape of my hair my hair is also really really thick even though it keeps falling out it's I'm blessed to have thick hair because otherwise I think my medicine would have a more noticeable effect on my hair but this is going to be super helpful for that because it's like a big paddle brush that will get right under there and everything so I'm super excited to get it out and try it <laughs> this is Percy Pig these are the ones that are Percy loves Penny um and i've never had these before i don't know they're the normal percy pig ones but i don't know what penny is made out of but yeah this came in the hamper with the pillow so this is up on my arm so that was actually three bags of percy pigs this is the cute little box that my necklace came in so it also came with this like really cute little pouch and in the pouch is like a perfume dropper that um my nan said i could use to put the stuff into the necklace next is also i told you i needed socks they were on my christmas list and my nan has got me these really really cute socks look at the little sheep it's so adorable and these ones have cute little robins in so i literally i can't wait to wear these because they're so adorable <laughs> i love why do i love socks so much they're literally socks <laughs> so she also got this selection of makeup so these i which i have used some of them and some of them i haven't done so i'm like super excited to try so a brand that i've not used before is natural collection and these this is a little brow like a powder kit i usually use powder on my brows so this will be really like useful uh 
it looks the right shade as well and this one is a clear mascara I don't own any clear mascaras so hopefully this will be really cool I could probably use it as brow gel as well because it's clear and I'm really excited to try it because I've literally never owned a clear mascara I always use the same one so it'll be different and then this is the uh, Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara. I've used this before and I do really like it. So I will hopefully get some use out of that. This is the NYX Micro Brow Pencil in the shade Brunette, which I've never had before. So I'll be really, uh, be really cool to try out a brow pencil. It looks about the same shade. Hopefully it'll be the same shade. Um, but it looks really cool, doesn't it? I never, like I said, I've never, I have used the brow pencil, I've only used the Maybelline one and I found that one a little bit too red for my tone. And this one is a Super Stay 24 hour colour uh, sensational lipstick. Ah, oh, there's a, it looks like there's a lip balm and a lipstick on here. So this is in the shade In The Nude and it looks really cool. I love Maybelline lipsticks, they're my favourite. I literally never not use Maybelline and I'm really happy about that. And then lastly in this bag, there is two books. So this is The Inheritance Game by Jennifer Lynn Barnes and this is The Final Gambit. Before you ask why I didn't ask for the Hawthorne Legacy, I have already read this book but I needed to reread it before I could read the second one. So I bought the second one because my mum said, you know, you don't have to own all of the books, but then it was sat there on my shelf and it was annoying me that I didn't have the first one. So I asked for the first one and then the third one has just come out so I can read them all in one go and finish the series, which I'm super, super excited about because I did really enjoy the Inheritance game. I think I must have read it about two years ago now. And then this one is The Atlas Paradox by Olivier Blake and this is the sequel to The Atlas Six and it's really pretty and it's got illustrations in it again. I love I love these books, they're so pretty. I was a bit on the fence about The Atlas Six but I'm really excited to read this one to sort of like see where it goes, if it goes anywhere else and I read it quickly. Um, no, I mean I read it like in December or November I read it recently so it's fresh in my mind so I can pick it up again and get back into it. I probably should put it on my January TBR so I get to it and don't then I have to read another one and also isn't this bag like really cool it's got like look I've never seen a Christmas bag it's got disability rep I love disability rep uh, as a disabled person myself you don't see it very often this is from my boyfriend's parents I'm pretty sure and I'm so grateful um I can't open the box to show you guys so my my boyfriend always calls me the Rosie but because he's he's special <laughs> um and this says your the Rosie or it says you're the bowl I don't know I keep reading it as you're the Rosie anyway it's really cool it's a citrus bath bomb so that's really cute and a really cute ah uh, I'll take the bubble wrap off so you can see I can then I can take it out of the the isn't it so cute it's also from a place called belly button designs and I find that so funny but yeah isn't that so cute I think I it's almost too nice to use so I think I might have it as a decorative mug but I really really love it look how cute it is and it sits the, the bath bomb sits nicely on top but yeah it's so cute so yeah that was really sweet of them as well they um they didn't have to get anything it's really nice also in the Percy Pig hamper was the Percy Pig Loves Penny mug and a cute little plush of Percy. Isn't it just adorable? I love it so much. I have way too much Percy stuff, but <laughs> look at him. I could probably do like a whole Percy Pig collection now, I'm not gonna lie. This one is from my mum, but this is another diamond art. This one is a cute little butterfly. 
like I said I love doing diamond art so this was so much fun I mean this will be so much fun to do but yeah <laughs> this is a flutter by silver I have done a butterfly before um but that one's different and the butterfly was really fun because it had like lots of different sections so it was easy to finish a section and stop and then restart it also in the percy pig hamper was one of the percy pig totes this one's one of the big ones it's even got like um a hard bottom in so it's perfect for shopping and it's literally as big as my head <laughs> They are so cute. I got one for my birthday, but it was one of the small ones. So now I have two Percy totes. So no excuse, I should keep them in my car so that I always have a shopping bag on hand. For my parents, I also got uh, instant camera uh, Polaroid refills. Well, they called Instax Mini Instant Film. And I have opened it already because I used some on Christmas Day. But yeah, um, that was... I, lo I love getting refills because I love those. I've got a frame of them all up on my wall and it's so cute. Also from my parents, I got two Nintendo Switch games. That is uh, the Danganronpa Anniversary Collection. I played the first one of these on my brother's PSP about probably like three or four years ago now. And I saw they were, had a collection out and I was like, I need it because I want to play the rest of them. And... I think this will be so fun so i'm excited and i also got pokemon scarlet and i'm really excited to play the pokemon games um because i had pokemon sword i really loved that and i used to play pokemon diamond and i got the remastered on my switch and i was really loving that it's actually really hard though compared to the new pokemon games and um i've got the i can't remember what it's called the pokemon R chaos is that what it's can't remember what it's called now it's so bad but i have that as well i just i love pokemon so much <laughs> and i can't wait to get to them i have to keep reminding myself to charge up my switch though because i literally forget to do it and it's not good <laughs> also from my parents i got a matching set of um the percy pig uh pajamas and i wore them last night they're super super cute and I love Percy Jam. These are so comfortable. I literally would live in them if I didn't have to go out to work and stuff. They're so cute and they're so soft. And they got Percy's happy little face on, so you wake up to that every single day. Now I have the Percy short pajamas, the Percy dark grey pajamas, and the Percy light grey pajamas. I nearly have them all. Something a bit funny that my mum got because she thought it'd be funny is the Percy Pig pants and I'm just gonna leave it at that because I'm not entirely sure where the pants are too far but I have them now so it is what it is <laughs> what my my nan got me this it's a uh, this is a knitting bag so you can keep all of your knitting needles and your woolen balls and stuff in the bag she also got me lots of things that i've put in here to keep safe <laughs> so these are knitters needles this is a row counter for knitting and this is a whole bundle of knitting accessory kits it's got like a ruler with like knitting needle sizes it's got a tape measure it's got like counters and needles and things I don't know what they are so I'll have to ask her but it's really thoughtful I've been recently trying to get in well I've been I've made a cow like I told you and I've been trying to get into knitting and like doing it therapeutically because it's really been helping me with mindfulness and it's something fun to do when the tv's on and these are a pair of sewing sewing scissors which are always always handy and this isn't related to knitting but this is diamond dot this is the an extra couple of trays grips the the wands and the, the wax so i thought that that's really helpful because it really helps with like now i have everything that i could possibly need for knitting so 
and this cute little bag keeps everything together i can't wait to put all of my wool and stuff so all my projects are kept nice and safe in here it's such a thoughtful present and the bag is so cute as well it's got little um squirrels and owls and foxes i love it i love it this bag of stuff is mostly from my parents so i got some more percy pig socks i've had a set of these before but they've gotten all the elastics like come off so i asked for some more and i'm so happy i love my socks i also got a few craft kits so this is a make your own felt pug pillow and there is a little dangly dog felt sewing kit and uh, make your own felt sloth so this should keep me busy so i also got for my boyfriend this is i just put these in here to keep them safe so this is a bath oil i do believe it's called ghost the fragrance and i'm not entirely sure what it smells like because it smells kind of like spicy uh it doesn't have like a descriptor on the bottle but it smells nice so it will be nice to put in the oil the bath i mean because it is oil i can't speak and he also got a selection of face masks so this is a glycolic sheet mask from super drag this is a moisture bomb nighttime eye tissue mask deep sea water and hyaluronic acid from garnier i love the garnier skin mask it's so good and then this one is a beauty laundry radiate and glow sheet mask and these are two super drug foot masks this one is tea tree and peppermint and these are honey and almond i've never used these before i don't know what they'll be like but they sound fun so i'm looking forward to trying them out i've never used a foot mask so this should be fun also from my parents i got a new professional primer i love this this is my swear by primer i always use it it makes my skin look so much better and a little mini better than sex mascara i love this mascara it's my favorite mascara and lastly in my bag i got this is the CeraVe Blemish Control Gel with AHA and B. A. I'm really excited to try this because I love CeraVe. This is the CeraVe Blemish Control Cleanser, which I'm really excited to try because a lot I haven't found the right one and this one is new. So I'm hoping this will be for my skin type. This one is the CeraVe Hydrating Cl uh, Cream to Foam Cleanser for normal to dry skin, which I'm excited to try. Also, I can double cleanse for different types of cleansers and also lastly this is a body uh body one so this is sa smoothing cream so this is for dry rough and bumpy skin which i'm really looking forward to because i don't know it's not psoriasis but i'm not sure it could be psoriasis but this whatever it is it can help so i'm looking forward to trying this i need to put it in the bathroom so i remember to use it right last couple of things so i also got another t-shirt I, I wore this yesterday so like i need to show it to you so this is the look how cute it is tell me that's not adorable i love it i love it it's amazing also this is probably this is inside out for a start but this is probably my favorite <laughs> that i got look at it it's amazing it's the percy pig hoodie from marks and spencers it's so soft it's so cute it's so big and warm. it's like wearing a giant blanket and i love it especially because i get so cold so i'm really happy with it i love it so much and lastly i have a couple of books to show you so i got belladonna by adeline grace i've heard so many good things about this it's such a beautiful book so i'm really really looking forward to reading this and i got a touch of ruin by scarlet st Clair. i loved a touch of i think it's a touch of darkness 
yeah it is a touch of darkness i love that so i'm really looking forward to reading this hopefully it's a good continuation and i also got it starts with us by colleen hoover i did enjoy it ends with us i'm not entirely sure how it can have a sequel so i'm really looking forward to jumping into this also there's a couple of things i can't show you because of the nature of them so i got five games on steam from my boyfriend so i got a game called timberwolves i've got house flipper i got the tenants i got clans folk and i got house of thieves um which are real, I'm really looking forward to jumping into those games. They look so much fun. And I also, he's also got me a Kindle. This, this boy, <laughs> I'm so lucky. He, I'm, I'm really looking forward to, he got me a Kindle. A Kindle Paperweight, the new one with no ads. I'm really looking forward to getting it. It just didn't come in time for Christmas for me to show you. Um, but yeah, I'm really looking forward to getting it. <laughs> yeah, so also I am going to be going shopping for stuff like next week some point. And I'm going to be treating myself to some lovely new clothes and some books that I didn't get on, that were on my Christmas list and some other little bits and bobs so I might make a part two of Christmas presents that I treated myself to <laughs> well but yeah I Thank you for watching this video um i hope you enjoyed seeing that what i got for christmas let me know in the comment section down below what you got for christmas i'd love to know thank you for watching this video and once again no way am i trying to brag i'm so grateful for all of these everyone has been so thoughtful and kind and i truly have been spoiled and i'm so lucky so thank you so much yeah thank you for watching this video if you liked this video please leave a thumbs up comment down below any questions you have for future videos and i hope to see you in the next one bye for now guys